SpongeBob SquarePants first episode date. 1st of May 1999. I guess today is the only day you can upvote this. I'm going to upvote this tomorrow. Okay, calm down, mad lad. R slash ask Reddit. You are the last adult in the world, and all of the children, 12 and under, are coming to kill you. What is your defense plan? Go to a PG-13 movie. Whenever a kid in school asked me to spell iCup, I would just keep spelling it E-Y-E-C-U-P until they got annoyed. And I asked, well, how are you supposed to spell it? And then they would spell it out and own themselves and never recover and have to change schools every time. Self-esteem obliterated for life. Man, this guy's got no chill. How could you roast someone that hard? So, uh, my uncle got a drone. Now he's messing with people. <laughs> I hate this so much because I didn't think of this. I really want to do this. You know, if this video gets 50k likes, I'll do it and upload it to my Instagram. Cop. Who the hell ordered all these pizzas? Me. You said I got one phone call. Arrested man orders pizza to police station. Gets in more trouble. Psh, yeah, who needs to call a loved one when you can buy pizzas? <laughs> we had a kid at our high school who refused to speak for the entirety of our high school career, even if a teacher called on him. The day we graduated, he spoke for the first time. His reasoning for his four years of silence was, just because I could. What a madman. I'm six foot three, but I say I'm six foot one to hurt people who are 5'11 and claim they are six foot. Hey man, don't bully us 5'11 boys, okay? We're close to six foot, but we're not there yet. You don't think we're insecure about our height already? I rate this book five stars. I am the author, and I think I did a pretty good job. <laughs> You can't leave your own rating on your own book. Russian car YouTubers are literally building tanks out of Bentleys. Oh my gosh. How much more Russian can you get? This is so amazing. I think the song is Bleed, but don't quote me on that. I think the song is Bleed. Shredder 94. We get it, you're cool. My idiot furry son has one job at night. Bork at things and make them go away. Easy, right? However, a bear has learned that my fairy son can be bored. This is the third time he's been gifted deer bones in exchange for being allowed to access my trash. And he keeps doing it. Leave him alone, okay? He just wants some deer bone. He's only a dog. The teacher did one of those word cloud things with a virtual response thing for the question. What makes water so special? <laughs> I submitted the word wet 600 times. <laughs> I'm sure the class hated you that day. Guys, uh, I have a confession. I'm 37. I tell people I meet I'm 57 in order to receive compliments about how young I look. That's actually smart, what the hell? I will never tire of sending random messages like this to random numbers. It's done! From this moment forward, we don't know each other. Sorry, uh, who is this? Very good. <laughs> Customer at Subway wants to speak to the manager. I worked at a Subway that didn't have any authority slash managers. Just a couple of minimum wage base level workers. I don't remember what this particular customer was mad about, but she was arguing with me and didn't like the answer I gave her. She asked to speak to the manager, and there, not being a manager, I decided to promote myself on the spot and replied with, Manager speaking, how can I help you? This did not make her very happy, because she realized she was not going to get a different answer and asked for a phone number to call. The owner has specifically told us never to give his cell number to customers, so I gave her the store number. She gives me a horrible grin thinking about how much trouble she's about to get me in when the phone behind me starts to ring. I will never forget the face she gave me as I answer the phone, look her in the eyes and ask, how may I help you? <laughs> All right, I put Spider-Man temporary tattoos on my entire body. I am Spider-Man, man. <laughs> what? What the hell? This guy won't be able to leave the house for a, at least a week. People of Reddit, what is it like to be super attractive? This is Reddit. There are no attractive people here. I mean, he ain't wrong. <laughs> there goes my hero. Man fights off shark, stitches up own leg, goes to the pub. New Zealander man James Grant stabs Predator with a knife to get free, swims ashore, Stutch's wound and goes to the pub for a beer. <laughs> what? 
This is the king of all mad lads. I sent my dog outside for standing on the dining room table. This was his response. <laughs> Rebellion. You don't let me stand on the inside table? I'll stand on the outside table. Trump arrives in Louisiana. Nobody. Louisiana's governor. <laughs> he just doesn't care. He thinks it's so funny. <laughs> He's got Trump socks. I'll straight up eat a club sandwich at a cottage and cottage cheese at the club. I really do not care anymore. Chill, man. These levels of mad laddery are just going through the roof. May the first be with you. May the second be with you. May the third be with you. May the fifth be with you. Just gonna do every day except the 4th of May. Doesn't anger me any bit. Nature is weird. I just watched a beetle climb a huge tree, fight like five other big beetles, and throw them off said tree. He then proceeded to mate with the female at the top, and once he finished, this dude just yeeted her off the tree too. <laughs> this ain't no r slash mad lad. This is an r slash mad beetle. One day, Billie Eilish was walking outside and she saw a boy crying. She said to him, Here kid, have a roll of air conditioning pair coil. 1 out of 4x, 3 out of 8, 4, 10, 8, 20 meter polyethylene UV protected insulated copper heat resistant to 120 Celsius. You're destined to do great things. That boy was Elon Musk. And I am forever grateful. The man himself, Elon Musk, confirmed this. I love Elon Musk so much. <laughs> you are given immortality. You can't be damaged or killed. What is the first thing you try? Run with scissors. Yeah, actually, I would try that, yeah. <laughs> I hijacked a train. Capitalize the I, you barbarian. Oh, my bad. I hijacked the train. Hey, Andy. Hey, Andy. Hey, Andy. Hey, Andy. Hey, Andy. Hey, what? Is your refrigerator running? Yeah. Haha, <laughs> you fool! You have fallen prey to one of my tricks! I was not interested in the operational condition of your refrigerator. I was simply conducting a sleight of hand in the form of clever wordplay. What I was referencing was the movement of your refrigerator in the form of physical running, which is simply preposterous! Drat! Foiled again! My Aunt Cheryl just created a group chat called Cheryl's Surprise Party and then left the group. I'm feeling a lot of emotions, but mostly respect. <laughs> it's kind of sad, but that's a great idea. <laughs> I wish every idiot on Reddit got their account deleted. Granted. Hold up. That mad lad actually deleted his account for the meme. He did! What? 30 likes and I'll drop this $10 code. Here's the code. <laughs> Giving your boss a formal letter of resignation like a professional employee? Quitting by using a meme. Uh, my last day will be the 15th of May. Sincerely regards. Today my diet has consisted of five guys and Popeyes, so I'm probably gonna live forever. You ate five whole people? Six counting Popeye. This comment is edited, so the replies make no sense. Because children are radioactive. Hold up! <laughs> what? Uh-oh. Once you see him pull out the compass and the calculator for 8-ball, you know you're dead. I wish I could get 1 platinum, 4 golds, and 15 silvers for spamming my keyboard. Like this? He actually got it! Wow! So, uh, I blocked my ex on everything, but she somehow managed to message me through DirecTV. I'm sorry, okay? I just miss you! Hello? Who are you? Andrew. And... Rue? <laughs> well guys, that is the end of r slash mad lads part 12. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. That'd be greatly appreciated if you could do so. And also maybe even share this video to one of your friends or family members. It'd be also greatly appreciated if you could go down below in the description, because I have a couple links. I've got my social media links, like some cool designs on shirts and hoodies if you want to check them out and support me. I've also got social media, like my Instagram and my Twitter, if you want to follow me over there, see updates on my next videos I'm gonna upload, or just my daily life, you know? And also, lastly, a big thank you to all my Patreons. I do have a Patreon link down below in the description, and you can get your name up on the board, and you can get some other perks if you want to go ahead and look at that. That'd be greatly appreciated. Before that said, hopefully you enjoy the video, and I'll see all of you guys on the next one.